Good morning. Storms are on the way today and it's already raining across northwest Iowa from Fort Dodge down through Boxholm and Boone. We've got a few stronger thunder showers early today. You can even see a little bit of lightning there showing up on Lightning Tracker. Back through Jefferson, Lake City, Rockwell City, general thunder showers as well. They're all tracking up to the northeast. Jewel's getting some light rain right now, but that stronger thunder shower will be moving into town over about the next 15 minutes or so. Story City kind of on the edge of it. Back through Panora now approaching Adel. We have a few more raindrops and they extend westward toward Audubon. We're expecting this to move out, replaced by a bit of a lull for the middle part of the day, and then a risk for severe storms. This occurs late this afternoon and toward the evening. The higher risk for severe weather along and south of I-80, including the Des Moines area and especially southwest Iowa. And if we can break out into sunshine today, that will add fuel to the storms. So this morning, those thunder showers will lift to the northeast. By noon, it's still going to be pretty quiet out there for much of the state. Now, by 4 p.m., we're expecting the storms to develop across southern and southwest Iowa quickly becoming severe, especially if there has been any sunshine. By 6 p.m., the thunder showers begin to move in toward the metro and then quickly out of here. Already by 8 p.m., future cast showing most of the thunderstorms will be east of I-35. That's behind the cold front. We'll have some quieter weather pushing in for the rest of the evening, possibly even just a little bit of shower activity overnight and into early on your Thursday. Hit or miss showers possible on Thursday, too. Now, the thunder showers today will be some pretty efficient rainfall producers, the ones to the northwest this morning morning, about a tenth to a quarter of an inch per hour. The ones later on this afternoon could dump an inch of rain across the southeastern part of the state. So this system is just arriving across western Iowa here. The area of low pressure will lift quickly to the northeast by around 8 p.m. That's when that cold front will begin to nudge right through central Iowa. The best chances for severe weather along and ahead of it. Then tomorrow, cooler weather pushes in behind. For today, it will be warm in between the storm. 68 degrees, the high temp today with that risk for severe weather after 3 p.m. lasting through the the evening. Overnight thunder showers ending and tapering off to just a little bit of drizzle. Overnight lows near 48. And tomorrow we'll have off and on showers. It's going to be a blustery, cooler day. The winds of change will be howling tomorrow with a high of 54. And even on Friday, we can't shake the chance for rain there. But over the weekend, better weather arrives. But tonight,